In most cases, stop pore construction joints allow the joint to open and close with expansion and contraction. What if we wanted to create a stop pore construction joint that didn't open and close, but rather act as a single slab? You could scabble the face of the joint with a scabbler or use retarder to create an exposed aggregate finish. But what if you could create a scabbled surface without any additional time or labor? G'day, my name's Josh, and on this episode of Concrete Compass, we'll be covering a not so well-known type of sacrificial or permanent formwork, expanded mesh. The formwork features ribs every 90 millimeters to provide strength and rigidity to hold back the concrete, whilst the open mesh and angled tabs create an extremely coarse bonding surface. The open mesh also allows for dowels, reinforcing, or even post-tension strands to pass through the formwork for load transfer or shear resistance. When the first pour has set, simply remove the bracing and you're left with a surface with an exceptional mechanical key ready to continue pouring. In fact, tests have confirmed that expanded mesh joints have a higher bond strength and shear than a conventionally formed exposed aggregate joints. It's also extremely easy to work with, although using gloves is a must when installing expanded mesh. It can be easily cut to size using a small grinder or snips and supported using regular LBL timbers for alignment. So next time you're forming a construction joint like this, give expanded mesh a try. It's quicker, easier, cheaper, and best of all, a better joint. If you've got any further questions about expanded mesh or anything else concrete related, get in touch with one of the team at Allcon today. And if you've learned anything from this video, please hit the like button and make sure you're subscribed or following so you don't miss out on our next episode. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next week.